the, the problem here is let's say today your backend team has said that they are using this particular URL so you are using it from the digital file so tomorrow if they say that they have another URL to which we have to connect so we have to change the digital file again correct and again we have to select the newly modified digital in our service configuration so it will be a tedious task so that's the reason we don't usually go with the static from digital option so the next possible option is static backend so when you choose it as a static backend it will ask you to update the backend url over here so if you see here when you choose it as a static backend and if you just scroll down you can see there is an option called backend url so whatever the url to which you have to connect from data path you need to update that url over here okay so automatically whenever the data power service receives a request those request will be forwarded to this url what you have updated over here okay so static from visdel means your backend application url will be chosen from the visdel visdel file and if it is a static backend whatever the url that you are going to update it at the service level configuration so all the request will be routed to that particular url so if there is any change in the backend url you have to come to your service and you have to update that new url over here by re removing the old url clear static backend and static from digital now let's say the other possibility is let's assume that i have a requirement wherein based upon certain parameters let's say i have a country name as a parameter i'm just taking as an example let's say equal to india when i get this request as per, when i get any such request where country name equal to india in that case i have to send this request to one url let's assume that https colon slash slash www.amazon.in let's say i'll get a request called country name equal to us so in that case i have to route this request to amazon.com so you have two different urls based upon the parameter we have to <coughs> decide to which url you have to invoke so now if i use it as a static backend can i use this scenario can i implement this using a static backend see static means as the name itself indicates the backend url is always fixed but here we are trying to route the request dynamically based upon certain parameters so in this way where you have to do a content based routing or a dynamic routing we choose a